but it, it just sounded fun to say. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's it pretty good. And then we have uh, KH Arma. Now, Arma, you know, he used to play Corrin, and he tells me he still plays Corrin, but I don't see the Corrin, and I want to see the Corrin. Dude, I saw Arma go into an absolute nail-biter against Elegy. Uh, Wednesday night fights in last week? Oh, yes. Yes, that was that a good was a set. That was a crazy set. That was a good set. So I was really looking forward to seeing more action out of this player. Mm -hmm. Here we are. We already had a Palutena on stream, too. Uh, I'd like to see the differences between the two. I mean, I already kind of see how Arma plays. Arma likes to use that shield a lot. And I don't mean his shield when you hold the triggers. I'm talking about when he dash attacks you or bears you in the face. It very impressive. You don't really expect that out of a character like Palatina because it's very easy to play that from a more zoning perspective. So when you can take a character like that and stay in someone's face, it's really hard to deal with. That was some really good stuff from the Link, though. I really like the, how oh, he was yeah. using the bomb. We're, we're talking about the aggressive Palatina play. It cost him a stock already. Ero Devastetes. Ero Devastetes. Shows up. You can do it. Oh. I like the bomb stuff. I really do. And he even did Ooh. the... Oh, this man. I, I really think Link, over time, is going to become more and more of a thing. You can create so many interesting traps with the bomb by having it detonate at the right moment that uh, it can be very disruptive to anyone's playstyle. And I think Arrow is devastating. Right now. Uh -huh. I think the scariest thing to be told is that... Who do you play? Oh, I play uh, Link and Snake. Oh, okay. <laughs> okay, bye. Uh -oh. Understood. Okay, missing that forward air. And, uh, oh. Not the best punish. Yeah, you're gonna get punished for your proper ugh. hold, please. Uh huh. That was uh. Yeah, both players knew the writing was on the wall there. So, yep. Yeah, go ahead and go ahead and swing that out. And if anything, letting it go sooner might have thrown Arrow off long enough for him to try to roll out. Mm. Okay. Uh, using the boomerang to cover, I I like that. I like that. Didn't really use it a whole lot, but the backer is finally gonna catch. I want to get three stock. Interesting up B is going to allow Arma to get the neutral air. Combos that. Finds a jab afterwards. Looks like Arma's starting to get a rhythm going, but is it too little too late for this game? Oh, absolutely not. No, Arma definitely knows how to make those comebacks. And with those shields being as strong as they are, uh, it'll be interesting to see how he gets through all these projectiles. Like the back air. Oh. Oh, that was really smart. Really smart movement by Arma. Just trying to avoid as much damage as possible. And he, I'd say he got out in a pretty good way. Yeah, I feel like both players have taken shots across each other's respective bows. And now they can start to slow down. But oh, Arma steps on the pedal. He's like, I don't care about this sword. Up, Aaron. That's your second stop. Okay, explosive flame looking good. 95% though. That is going to be one smash away from game showing up on the screen oh. down air not able to connect in that looks for the neutral air gets the back end of it okay oh pomegranate Ooh, here catch long. okay throws grenade out throws the boomerang comes back at you fast 127 percent throws the grenade up top looking for fireworks not able to get the kill oh yeah oh. i saw as soon swing as he better swing as soon as he threw out that bear the way that he did i could already tell there was a punish just waiting and it happened you know, earlier you were saying an opinion thrown out there is that Young Link's the worst of the three. The more we see these interesting gadget-style plays from Link, the more that might start to be true. Starting to believe it? I don't know. I mean, I really like the way that the, the fire arrows work, and I really like the way that uh, he's just small and quick, and he's... I like the original bomb, but, I mean, that's because my brain's not developed enough as a human <laughs> to be able to deal with Link stuff. But I, I really like what I saw here from Arrow. It's really nice stuff. Uh, drink some vitamin D milk, you know. Build strong bones for a grown boy. Oh, I drink almond milk. I don't know. Uh, that's right. That's right. <laughs> right now, I'm just trying to zone for the moment. Get yeah. some combination in after the neutral air. 43% is the net total. Neutral air to forward air. All you new Palutena mains. Definitely uh, put that in your back pocket. One thing we are seeing differently from Arma's Palutena is he's using the upbeat to get back onto the stage rather than the ledge. I don't think you really see that out of a ton of Palutena's. So Arrow's going to have to really stay on the toes because if you're looking to set up the edge guard and Palutena shows up behind you, that could be a tilt attack to your face. 
Mm -hmm. I really like the, the back air from Arma, too, when he hit just underneath the shield and was able to do it just completely safely. Really smart stuff. Shows you just how well Arma knows his character. Goes for the down air. That's going to get shielded and punished. Double up air. Arma's going to enjoy that every day of the week. Hits a triple. 106%. Not enough for the takedown. Immediate back. They're looking for the end. Okay. I like the I like the ledge trapping option. Uh, just throwing out the down tilt to try to bait uh, Arrow into doing something silly. Back with the trick. Next, just zoning out. Alex is like, oh, this is what it feels like. Getting around these grenades, but not able to take out the first stock just yet. Ooh. Right now, the zoning game is strong for both players. Seriously, I love how Arrow uses his bombs. Like he just nares straight into it as soon as he throws it. <laughs> Did I just see it reflect? Saw Barry as well. Oh. Upbeat is going to get blocked, punished. We've seen Palatin in his back air get take get stocks all night. There was a better Not punish. Not able to do so, but there was, uh, sets up the pump. There was a better punish than that throw, but uh, we ended up getting a really sweet explosive flame out of it. Ooh, in the back air, just crossing you up, kid. Right now, Arrow's trying to get this first stock. Does not want to allow Armin to start running away with the game. That is going to be it. Solid shot in the face. Use these specials that close to a sword. You could have a bad time. You're gonna have a bad time. Good. Good. Okay, you got the start. You got the South Park reference. Okay. Very happy. To yeah. Ooh. But Arrow has shown the ability to rack up percentage at the lower end. Grenade is gonna claim that ledge for the moment. Mm -hmm. The zoning capability at Grenade is always so interesting. You just have to watch out. You really do. Oh, oh explosive flame looking good. Are we gonna see an up air? Oh no. Okay. Okay, good cross up from the Nair. Whoa, that killed. Excuse me. Was that a DI thing, do you think? That had to have been a DI thing. It didn't seem like it had the velocity to really just claim the stock outright. And I think there was a way to come back. That was some Smash 4 velocity. <laughs> okay. All the way up, getting some chip damage, 13%. Take whatever you can get at this point. Arrow yeah. goes out, just misses, further zoning with the grenade. Ooh. Arma is going to be able to weave around that. Gets back on the stage, gets back to business. Mm, yeah. Looking to do damage. Arrow had a really good uh, ledge trap there. Okay. Ooh. Oh, the forward tilt almost took Arma out. Another instance where we see the in neutral explosive flame. It's spooky. I, I'd be I'd be cautious to be first. Arrow's really, uh, plays really confidently with his character. I like the way that he approaches Link. 25%. That was a bad explosive that, flame. That's what happens when you just throw out the random explosive flame. The in lag of that is enough for a quick force man to get out. Okay, the pomegranate's not really working out. Oh, okay. Just kind of spacing it out right now. I, I really enjoy that from Arrow. Playing it very patiently. It's an interesting form of denial, leaving that grenade out there. Mm -hmm. Arrow goes over, is going to get picked up. The grenade after the roll gets thrown by Armas. That's going to miss 95%. Looking for a back air, looking for a potential in their combination. Throws up the shield. Arrow's on the ropes, but uh, can still turn his way. Ooh, that forward tilt. That's going to set up in a pretty bad position for Arrow. Ooh, two flame? I don't know, but that was oh. such a good explosive flame, and the up air is going to take oh. that. Wow. Arma's out here playing it fast and loose. I thought going off the stage, they would hit the bottom of the blast zone. That was... That, that was, was real close. That was a smart last 20 seconds from Arma there. Well played. I like that. Give me one second. Sure. I'll be right in. Another instance. I think we're going to game three. Again. Always cool to see these pools not be the foregone conclusion that some might think. I'm not too sure how much play Arrow Devastates has had in, in the SoCal region. Like I said, I'm pretty new to Southern California. But uh, they're playing like they have some experience under their belt, for sure. Mm. Have, you, have you seen Arrow play before? Um, I've seen Arrow around, but I've never uh, attributed a name to a face, and I'm very glad that I get to do that tonight, because I really like the link that I'm seeing right now. Uh, the way that he throws out the the nair after he throws a bomb out and just immediately gets it away from him. I, I really enjoy the way, like, like you were saying uh, about another character uh, early on today, every link player plays differently. Yep. Every link player plays differently. One of the more 
more creative characters in the roster. Right out of the gate for game three, though. Neutral air is netting value. Head guarding. Arrow is going to be able to get back onto the stage, but it comes at a cost. Mm hmm. Oh. Okay. Smart back air. Ooh, okay, okay. The back air is not really registering as the uh, Link gets back on stage. Okay. Neutral air to punish for this forward smash. Not going to be able to connect too much off of that afterwards. 89%. Explosive flame again mm -hmm. used in close proximity to the Link. Daring choices. Got to be careful with that. I mean, I guess he's trying to use the explosive flame as a counteraction uh, to uh, Link's projectiles. You don't have to worry about a projectile that just crack you in the face with a sword. Exactly, exactly. Just jump over. Yeah, and Arrow's shown that he knows how to move. He knows how to maneuver. Ooh, Ooh hanging out on that ledge, a, a hair long armor. Mm-hmm. Boomerang goes out, armor gets around that. Nice shot. Under 37%. Going for the edge guard. Up B. Arrow's back. Throws the shield out. It's forward air. Now they're trying to play the edge guard. Mm. I like that recovery from Arma. Go high. Mm-hmm. Right, getting caught with that boomerang, and that definitely allows oh! Arrow to get in. Oh. <laughs> Two gets sent into the magnifying, one doesn't come back. Mm -mm -mm -mm. Playing a game, tricking one another. Dash attacks hit. Link returns. Oh, that was smart. That was smart. That was smart play with the bombs, but he ended up getting a uh, shield to his face. Link's like, how come I can't use my shield in this game? That's good. I can't people with my shield. There's a grenade into the boomerang. We haven't really seen a lot of reflect out of Palatina. Now we might see that against the Link. Mm -hmm. Now, I, I can definitely see why he's not trying to throw out counters all day. Okay, good Nair. Very good Nair. I really enjoyed how he was able to just kind of... I thought we were going to go for another up air, but uh, no. There might have been more on the table there for that. But Moran goes out. That gets shielded. Armor dashes in. Trying to get aggressive up close to Palatina. Dash, con dash attack is going to connect. And another long-range explosive flame as, uh, as Link's standing right there. Yeah, I'm going to give him. Oh, we gotta be really careful about that. I think any Palatina needs to be careful about doing that. Oh, Nair not being spaced out properly, you're gonna get enough B for your trouble. Oh, here catch. That's not a game of catch I wanna <laughs> play. <laughs> the hottest potato of your life. So, ooh, Link ooh. rolls onto the stage, up B, not gonna get punished. Auto attack connects at the back end. Oh, these back airs. Arma's so good about doing that. Okay. Oh, dash dance. Oh. Getting ambiguous. Oh, you're gonna get punished. Oh, maybe not. Maybe we're not gonna get punished for that. I think I think I think he was already so committed to the aerial attack afterwards that it just didn't even think to go for a grab or something like that. Okay, this plus flame going super deep. The arrow gets back on, 8.3%. Looking to hold on to his stock as long as possible and rack up whatever damage they can. Mm -hmm. The armor's last stock. What? Armor's mm. looking to close this out right now. Yeah. Not even bothering to try to return back to the stage. I think he tried to, but he must have messed something up there, because I know Link can, can make it back from that. Okay, taking that bomb. You're not playing young Link's so game like bomb yourself in some kind of interesting way. Mm. Yeah. Okay. Oh, <laughs> I don't know what he's going to do with that. Actual hot potato being played. Four tilt just misses. Boomerang goes out into the grenade. 27% rack up from Palatina. Oh, that was a good like, reflect. Dash attack. There we go. That's when you want to use it. Oh! Oh! 